Well, JD, I was able to experience a different type of barbershop. The Purdue Varsity Glee Club is hard at work rehearsing for the busy year ahead. And this year, they plan to focus beyond the harmonies. The Purdue Varsity Glee Club has been a part of campus for over 115 years. Each year, the ensemble performs both nationally and internationally with an average of 50 to 60 appearances. I was able to sit in on a rehearsal to see how the magic happens. We really don't know what we're going to sing until the day of. Um, Bill will tell us what songs are going to be on the show list, and then we just have to be ready to sing them. So these songs we're getting ready for probably the shows that are happening next weekend, um, and we're gonna sing those at those events. And, but they're usually just home shows, just at old high schools, at churches, they can be wherever. The Glee Club can be found in their timeless tuxedos, spreading smiles around campus. But as this new year approaches, they hope to go beyond their typical repertoire. So there are two things that we're um, really um, uh, sort of increasing um, or making better in, in the group this year, and that's philanthropy, and then also social media. Uh, and then with philanthropy, we already do a little bit, um, but uh, we can do so much more. And that's something that we're really trying to do a better job of this year. One current philanthropy is the Penny War, where all the proceeds go to Natalie's Second Chance Animal Shelter. Whether focusing on helping others or spending time with each other, Purdue musical organizations have opportunities for all. There are so many opportunities in the Glee Club. It's just and in Purdue musical organization in general. You, if you are a singer, we would love to have you. We would love to have you audition and stuff like that. But um, we also have a bell choir if you want to play the bells. We also need people to be in our band. We need people to do the tech. If musical gifts are not your thing, the Purdue Christmas Show is December 7th and 8th. Tickets are already on sale. I have to say, this got me so excited for the Christmas show. I learned for students, it's buy one, get one free. I'm gonna have to get my t-shirt and I'll, I know that I'm gonna show up this year. Well, it sounds like I could give you my free ticket. Let's make a plan. That <laughs> sounds like a plan to me. Well, Mary, homecoming is just around the corner. Festivities will kick off on October 10th with the homecoming parade at 8 p.m. And then that following weekend is the homecoming football game that you're not going to want to miss. The Boilers to take on Maryland at noon. You can find more information online at purdue.edu slash homecoming. I know I'm not going to want to miss all the tailgates outside of Ross 8. That's all we've got for today's episode of Fast Track. I'm J.D. Arlen. And I'm Mary Callrider. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.